Welcome back to my channel and I know it's been so long since I uploaded my last video well life's been busy I've been so busy about work and gardening and k-drama and a lot more other duties and responsibilities so while I'm back welcome back to my garden and since I've been busy planting um, new crops the past months and weeks I think it's about time to do a part two of I ate nothing but eggs and food grown for my garden challenge so this is going to be more fun because I'd have more choices of food so stay with me in, for the next seven days as we do a part two of our I ate nothing but eggs and food grown from my garden challenge! And our food for day one would be pechai. So you see our pechai here are ready for harvesting. So we're gonna get some for our food for lunch and dinner too. For day one and we also got some string beans so this is good I think we're not going to get hungry this week <laughs> so here's our freshly picked string beans some of them are overdue for picking already if we won't be able to eat them today we will store them for consumption in the next few days nothing but eggs and food grown for my garden challenge and let's go food hunting um, I think we're going to have some beans and okra and papaya for day two it's a lot right let's go garden challenge and we are harvesting peanuts for our food for the day peanuts We also have another one, but it's not ready to be harvested yet. Let's see. Yay, we have one sinkamas. This would be our salad ingredient number one. We also have another sinkamas right here, I think. We'll get this one. Yay! This 
would make a good salad for our lunch. Salad ingredient number two. This is a leftover radish from the previous harvest. And look! Oh, shame. <laughs> it broke. <laughs> Sorry, radish. Salad ingredient number three. We have cucumber, the very first bunga of our cucumber. Hi guys, it's day four of our seven day challenge and these are our harvest for the day. Now I'm kind of confused what to eat for the day. So we have our organically grown pet chai and we have okra too. And we also have ingredients for a salad straight from the garden today. We have Sinkamas and cucumber and radish. I also picked some basil and some blue ternati too. So what do we have for our lunch today? Good morning! This is day 6 of our 7 day challenge and we are right here in our garden and um, I'm thinking of what to eat today. Maybe some pet chai or alugbate and okra. So join me as we go food hunting. Let's have some okra today too. So watermelon plant growing underneath our okra. And let's get some pet chai. And while everybody is eating this yummy food, because it's somebody's birthday. Ah, there's somebody. Happy birthday! The VP, no less. And I'm stuck with my usual food. <laughs> Okra, alubate, and pecha. Hi guys, good morning. And finally, we are on day 7 of our I ate nothing but eggs and food grown for my garden challenge part 2 and our food for the day nakahabol pa this is the very first bunga of our ampalaya and this will be our food for today I have to wrap it in net so that there will be no insect bites. Let's 
see that it's flawless <laughs> so happy this is the very first bunga of this ampalaya plant hopefully there will be more in the next days to come and this is our lunch for day seven ampalaya fresh from the garden and peanuts and a glass of cheese perfect hi guys so finally we are at the last day of our seven day challenge of i ate nothing but eggs and food grown from my garden challenge i am so happy this time because i had a lot of food choices unlike in part one if you have seen my video on the part one of this challenge i only had um, i think kangkong and alugbati and papaya most of the time but this time around, um, we had beans and ampalaya and peanuts too and um, what else? Pet chai. We had pet chai. And yeah, I'm so happy that my garden was able to provide me with the food that I need. I survived. I did not go I did not go hungry. In fact, I was even able to share pa some of my food to my friends and lunch mates. So we did it. I did it. And somehow this only inspires me and I hope it inspires you too to plant more. So in fact, right now with um, what used to be peanut field, I'm now planting sweet corn so that in the next few months we will enjoy some sweet corn as well and um, what used to be the garden plot of my pet shy i am now planting some lettuce so yeah um if we sow a seed sooner or later we will reap the fruits the food from that seed so i encourage all of you to plant so these plants came from a single seed imagine and that plant will give you a lot a lot that you can eat food that you can share with your friends no and that way the world will never go hungry so I hope you enjoyed this um, part two of our one week challenge. I promise there'd be part three. <laughs> and yeah, I'd like to do this as long as I can. No? So again, thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And stay safe everyone. Be happy.